More news, folks, and I don't like this news very much, but I got to tell you the truth. It looks like this uh, flood in the Carolinas was done on purpose. And not just mm. weather warfare and the, uh, the hurricanes being man-made, energized, and directed by Doppler radar, mostly, mind you. Um, but also three floodgates were opened on the North Fork River in Carolina. Now, don't, hold, don't take my word on this. Please do a little research on this because I'm sitting just in the dark, really, literally right now. But if the three floodgates were let loose at the same time, that would explain why those rivers washed out those people. So it was, and if this is the case, there's only one group that would open those floodgates. One of two, Bureau of Land Management, or Corps of Engineers. It would have been the federal government opening up those floodgates. Just like the federal government looks like they're the ones that created that hurricane, energized it and steered it in and put it up in the high country, which is like the first time I've ever heard of a hurricane at elevation like that. So I think that they've done this on purpose. And I also, I, I do think that FEMA has gone in there and they were interfering and they were uniformed up and FEMA was harassed by the locals because the locals realized what FEMA was up to. In other words, they've created a kill box. And uh, that FEMA was interfering with the uh, locals and the other people coming in to help. So they went after FEMA. They went after the agents of FEMA. And as a result, FEMA took off their identifications, uniforms, whatever it was that had them marked as FEMA. And they have... <clears throat> infiltrated the people and so if you're in Carolina and you find that these one of these government assholes one of these government agents that's helping out in this genocide and they're looking at it their goal is from what we can tell their goal is about a hundred thousand people that's what they figure they can get away with so they're going to do 70 80 thousand they're going to do a level they think they can get away with it what a way to steal another election to wash the voters out to sea and to lock them up so that they can't get any relief so they can't vote i'll bet you anything that they were targeted because, because it, they, it was known who they were going to vote for. I mean, that's a good possibility. At this point in time, we know that the left is targeting the right. They're using everything in their power, especially in their bureauc bureaucracies, to identify us and marginalize us. They do that. That's the way they are. And don't believe in coexistence because they don't. This is a war to them. This is a battle to them. And they're going to kill us if we let them. So my warning goes out to the Carolinas and the possibility that the floodgates, three of them, were opened up during the hurricane. Three floodgates at one time. Wow. Going down those rivers with God knows how big, how much water. No wonder those places were washed out. It wasn't just a hurricane. It was a government-caused flood, a man-made flood. This is all I'm going to tell you right now. That's all I got for you right now. Yahweh bless.